Welcome back everyone. And today we have Lego Star Wars Imperial Probe Droid. Set number 75306 with 683 pieces. Let's build it. And now it's time for the review of the probe droid. Um, I like the probe droid. Uh, it has a lot of small pieces, so it's very detailed. All your arms move and have working components to them. Some of them move in many different directions. Some of them only move in a few. But it's still a very detailed droid. The head moves around in a full 360 motion. And as you can tell, there's just amazing amounts of detail to this droid on every aspect. <clears throat> I really like what they did with the stand and the droid itself. Of course, the stand representing the snow in which the droid was shot by Chewbacca. You even have a little drill here on the back side. And they uh, gave you some extra cutting tools that you can put in place of the drill. They even gave you four of these, which is not in the instructions. Just like this piece is not in the instructions, so I'm assuming it's just an attachment for this little drill piece down here. Like you can take out the drill and pretty much put in what looks like a circular saw. Change out the tool and the function. Um, I would have to give this droid probably about an 8 out of 10. It was definitely a fun build. A lot of small pieces, so it is a little bit on the challenging side. It is rated 18 and up. But definitely definitely a good collection when it comes to droids. Definitely a, a, a nice addition to your collection. <clears throat> I also like what they did with the clear pieces on the stand. And they've got a... Uh, black uh, Technic piece in the center to help stabilize it. But you can pick it up and turn it around so you can have your droid facing any way. And of course the head swivels wherever you like it. Uh, it is a retired set. So if you're looking to pick one up, um, the average price, I think minimum new is $51 on BrickLink and someone has one for $999, you're never going to get that. But the average price is around $90 to $100. Bucks. It originally sold for $60. So not bad since it retired in December of 22. Um, almost 100% markup over the last year and couple months. But I hope you enjoyed the build and the review. 
and we'll see you on the next one. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and share this video. I am not paid or sponsored by anyone, but I am a Wicked Brick affiliate. Everything in uh, this room that you see that didn't come with a stand from Lego is either sitting on a Wicked Brick stand or in a Wicked Brick case. So please uh, use my link and check out the giveaway I'm doing with um, Wicked Brick Points on my Instagram.